What's up everyone, this is Cybernet8610, and today we will be opening up a Legendary Collection Game Board Edition. Uh, yeah, I think we've only opened up one of these, or maybe it's been two, I don't really remember. I thought it'd be cool to open up another one of these, I got it cheap, and, um, yeah. <laughs> what more do I need to say? This is Cybernet, we do openings. <laughs> a lot of opening videos, I like, I enjoy those. I try to mix it up a little bit more and have more duels and stuff, because I know you guys enjoy it, but opening videos are honestly my favorite things to do. Gotta love getting god cards, too, out of a box. I mean, come on. What more do I need to say? It's freaking god cards in a set. We gotta get it. <laughs> and a bunch of them. I don't have a problem. Stop any time. <laughs> anyway, we have Obelisk, Slifer, Raw, Blue Eyes, a Dark Magician, and Red Eyes. Still wish they were the old arts, but what can I say? I'm just going to keep complaining about that until, until forever, I guess, really. <laughs> Don't have anything clever to say. Uh, Legend of Blue is White Dragon. First pack ever released. Another reason why these are awesome to do an opening of. Right, we have Aqua Matador. And Gaia the Fierce Knight. There we go, ultra rare. Very nice. Older card, <laughs> seeing it in Hollow again, this is really awesome. A lot better than trying to find Legend of Blue Eyes uh, box, because those things are expensive. I know people want me to do an opening of that, but uh, if I can ever find one cheap, I will gladly do an opening of it. But I just can't justify spending $200 on a box that I know I won't get my money back. <laughs> I just don't see that happening. Alright, let's see, we have Fake Trap. Jinzo number seven. <laughs> oh, I should put the hollow to the side. I don't know why I didn't. There we go. So yeah, maybe in the future though, if I can ever find one cheaper or something. Uh, Spell Ruler. Maybe I should do that for like my four year anniversary that's coming up like in March. I don't know. Or we'll do another random hundred random pack opening or something. One or the other. Giant Rat. And Spellbinding Circle. That's a nice one. I love this card. <laughs> I remember always using this card, especially against my friends, because they all got Blue Eyes White Dragon, of course, you know, and I had Red Eyes, because I was that guy, you know? <laughs> so I remember getting Spellbinding Circles and stuff to use, and uh, that's how I could win. Oh, yeah, uh, Pharaoh's Servant. I keep forgetting to take out the pack before I open it. The Eye of Truth. There we go. Uh, Monster Recovery. Cool seeing a lot of these older cards. Dark Crisis. Let's get Exodia Necros. An M. Kendog. I believe that one is... Actually, a lot of people, I think, are looking for this one. Let's see, we have uh, Dark Scorpion Combination. And Different Dimension Dragon. Super rare. Very nice. I like this card. I think Kaba used it like once. One of the Guardians. I really like the Guardians too. I might build a deck profile. I don't know if it's even possible to make something halfway competitive with them. I always thought it was cool. I was glad they were actually in the anime uh, with uh, Raphael, which was... Golly, what was it? They they probably did that episode and all a lot, <laughs> a lot later after the cards were out. And uh, Invasion of Chaos. Those Guardian Monsters came out like way before. The whole Silvery Calco saga. Stray Lambs and Trap Jammer. That's an alright one. Super rare. Ryu Koki. It's pretty cool. So yeah, we pretty much almost got a hollow out of every pack. So that's definitely a win. Show you guys the hollows real quick. Let's see. Those are hollows. And of course these are the promo cards again. And one last thing we gotta get to. I'm sure people are... Wanting to see, you probably already know about this, but I feel like I should still do this, just in case somebody hasn't seen the Game Board. Why it's called the Game Board Edition. There we go. That's the Game Board. It's basically a play mat, just a cardboard like instead. And then let's flip it over. It has another picture on it. With Joey, Yugi, and Kaba. I really like this too. I wish this would have been made into a real play mat. Maybe they'll do some kind of mat thing or something. Some kind of tournament mat and uh, have that on it. As always, though, thank you for watching. Remember to come rate and subscribe. Hope you guys have enjoyed this opening. And tell me what we should open next. Like I said, I know a lot of people want to see some older box openings, but those are pretty dang expensive. But doesn't mean I won't be trying to find those. So, yeah, uh, if you know of any, like, cheaper ones, though, of course, I would like to hear those, too, because those are easier to do. <laughs> it's just that simple. And, uh, yeah, I will catch you guys later. See you.